I have a very important question to ask you. Are you the quiet kid at the back of the room? The one they're always asking to speak up? The character in a story that if you blink, you just might miss them. The background character's background character. Maybe even the misunderstood? Does this sound like you? If it is, well, hi. I'm that person too. It's that time of year where it's very warm, but mostly hot. There are parties left and right, events here and there, and a whole lot of socializing. Not to mention that everyone is outside. But what if you don't want to be outside? What if you just want to stay home and read your favorite book? Or play your favorite game that you couldn't play much during the semester? Or that personal project that you've had to put off because things just got too busy during school? Well, being an introvert and handling a holiday like summer is amazing because of all the cool projects I get to have all the time to work on, either in a game or in life. However, at the same time, and you most likely relate to this too, because you're on a holiday, one of, if not longest during a year, suddenly you're expected, either by family or maybe even friends, to go out and be outside and enjoy summer to its fullest potential. Believe me, there's definitely a time to be outside and enjoying the sun in a park or at the beach or something. But are you asking me to go out while considering how fast my social battery can run out? Or just asking because it sounds like fun and everyone else is doing it? See, I don't mind small gatherings. But I'm not necessarily itching to socialize either. If my battery is done, it's done. I need to have some time alone to recharge before I can do it again. The same goes for you too. I know you may have felt weird or like the odd one out in a group, in class, or wherever you thought differently. Too deep, as some may call it. But it's not like you can help it. That's just how your mind works. Aside from overthinking that happens every other second, a mind that active deserves to rest when it needs to, even if others may not understand why. And all of that's to say that you really should enjoy your summer the way you feel like it and the way that it would mean the most to you. You don't have to conform to the expectations of socializing every other day or every day and always going out, always trying to travel somewhere or something. If you planned a trip to travel and you really want to go, by all means, go. If you'd prefer to stay home and recharge or just take some time to recharge, do that too. If it means playing your favorite video game, and just chilling and enjoying being able to be free, go ahead. It's up to you and spend your summer in the only way that would really and truly make you happy. And don't fret and doubt yourself just because you're an introvert. You think differently and act differently and that's okay. All right. I'll see you later.